Hello everyone, it's just here again. I have some goes on today. Um, I've got a few a few cars just here. I've got plenty more in the bank. Today I'm going to be looking at uh, a bunch of mod packs from some different people, all to do with different types of cars and vehicles. So I'll primarily be looking at cars, touch on some of the other vehicles that some of them have, but I'll probably do a dedicated video for them. Uh, yeah, so I thought it was time to update my other one that I did a long time ago. Uh, I didn't realize it was going to go that well. This time it's going to be a bit better. And I've actually made a collection of all of these cars and a cool map and the resources that uh, some of these car packs need. So I'll have that link in the description. Uh, you guys can go there and choose what you what, what you want after seeing this video and all that sort of stuff. Uh, but yeah, so I've got uh, all these are different from different um, mod, mod makers. Most of them have been ported across from other games like Forza. Uh, Gran Turismo, um, Test Drive, all that sort of stuff. So they're all kind of detailed inside as well. Uh, so yeah, I'll go through each of those packs. Let me get rid of all these. Um, come over on here, why not? Okay. So I'm going to start off with S cars. I did this last time. Um, going down to the bottom, you can see all of these different cars. Spawn a couple in. For the most part, these S cars is probably the worst one here. In terms of model quality but there is a massive uh, variance on how many there are you can see inside it's a bit pixelated on the interior um, they drive quite nicely though which is the main thing of course and yeah and not all of them are bad just most of them um, and it's not bad bad it's just you know there's been less work put into them this one no it's not really good either I know this one's quite good yeah there we go textures are quite uh, decent on that one um, yeah, I'll have a bit of a drive of one just to show you what it's like. I'll go with Bikini, eh? I think this one inside is horrible because they are, um, how bad it usually looks. I really don't like the interior of Bikinis. Yeah, um, it's quite fast. Oh, don't want to drive off the edge. Oh, that was close. Yeah, so that's S cars. Uh, tons of stuff in there, and there's some military vehicles as well. Um, I won't have a big look at them. Like, there's a Hummer. Hummer? No, the Hummer, a tank. You go on the interior of this with a cool gun. Machine gun, a cannon. It's awesome. Um, yeah, there's more tanks and military vehicles up the top. I think they're all imported from Battlefield 3. I'm not going to have a big look at these. I'm just going to um, kind of spawn them in. Oh, gee, that's a big drop. Uh, so, yeah, they're, they're kind of cool. You can drive these and shoot and that, all, all that sort of stuff. This thing, this is massive. Wow, that would have been a good thing for the zombie truck. Anyways, um, so yeah, some of these you have seen from other videos that I've done. Some Batman tumblers, yeah, well, Batman tumbler and the old Batman vehicle. Some motorbikes. Motorbikes aren't real good because you can't like lean on them or anything. Uh, you see, they're kind of cool looking there. As you'll see when I drive them, you don't really lean, you just drive straight, which is a little bit odd. But anyways, they're still cool. Get some really cool ones um, around. So yeah, that's all in there, in the S-Cars, um, one of the S-Cars bikes pack or something like that. Um, I think that's about everything I will go and touch on, on here. Uh, I'll move on. And as you can see, there's cars imported from Trackmania and all this sort of stuff, and they're quite cool. But yeah, I need to move on, because I've got a lot to get through. Vehicles in here. Okay, I'll start off with the top. Uh, LW, Lone Wolfy cars. Uh, they're made by Lone Wolfy. Uh, he uploads, as, as you can see, there's not a whole lot here, but he's, I think he's only started more recently, and um, I believe that most of these, are, yeah, they, they get done fairly quickly. Um, I actually imported all these the other day, about two days ago, and then that these Cadillacs weren't there, and I went to check today to see if I got everything, and these were just, in, like, done, um, in the last few days, so keep that in mind, this is going to go out of date really quickly. I'll try and keep the actual collection up to date as best as possible, but I do have a life, so, you know, I actually need to spawn this Ferrari in twice, but the interior in these is just incredible. I mean, the amount of detail that is in this, and all these um, controls, radio, neutral, TC, I'm guessing that's traction control, panic, don't know what happens if you do that, it just shuts everything off, I guess, you know, drink, mix, Wash, oh I mean, it's, it's crazy. Valencia Delta, again, quite nicely modelled. Um, another race car with some more fairly complicated.
complicated controls, probably a little bit less com complicated because I think this is like from the 90s or maybe even 80s. It's a quite old uh, race car now. Because um, Subaru Impreza, um, I've actually been in one of these, so it's I can say that it's fairly realistic. Um, yeah, it's cool. So I should probably have a drive one of these. I'll get rid of all of them. This one, because this is the coolest. Uh, whoop. Ooh, don't want to go off the edge, and I'm just about to, and yeah, there we go. Um, <laughs> that didn't work out so well. This is probably not the best map to do this. I'll go somewhere where I've got a bit more room. Over here. I just wanted to do this because there is some uh, boats that I'd like to have a look at. Um, but yeah, they're, they're quite cool. Uh, Lone Wolfy cars, as I said, they, they he's doing a fair few of them really quickly, so... Uh, I saw this one on the main um, page. And it's not, oh, there's a lot of detail in this one. Uh, big Mercedes, is it G Series? I think? Yeah, G, G65. Um, flashy thing. Anyways, on to the next one. I think this guy stands for SGM. I think it's Sentry Gun Man. I think. Um, I do want to, yeah, I do want to say I'm probably going to balls up getting um, all the names right, that sort of stuff. There's a lot of. Um, because I've got to get through and I don't think they're all developed by one person but yeah so he's got some um, different ones he's got like this uh, RV from kind of like the Breaking Bad one it's kind of cool got a kitchens and everything in there um, got the, the, is it the AC Cobra or is it it's a Shelby Cobra it's um, getting very nicely rendered inside very simple car um, but yeah engine sounds and all that are quite cool in these uh, BMW, uh, I'm going to have to check that, M6, um, yeah, again, very nice, I don't actually like this car that much, I think it looks a bit like a boat, regardless, um, McLaren F1, sitting in the middle, sitting in the middle, it's just awesome, um, and again, detail is just fantastic, and yeah, it's it's just really nice to get the bus, it's, well, the seats are a little bit pixelated, but, um, Actual controls here, you know, you've got all the buttons on the side, open doors and turn lights off and all that crazy stuff. It's cool. Um, so yeah, that's uh, Sentry Gun Man's cars, or SGM cars. That actually requires a source pack, as do the S-Cars ones, but um, like a lot of the cars I think are in included in those packs anyways, so... Um, yeah, SGM cars requires a source pack, as does Sped Cars, which is down here. Um, Again, it, it is in the um, in that pack. Just make sure you scroll down and install that if you're installing any sped cars. When I get to them, uh, Slick Wolf cars. This guy uh, makes some cars which are a little bit less realistic, a bit more cartoony, arcadey, whatever you like to say. But they're kind of cool nonetheless. Um, this is why I wanted to spawn in some. I wanted to be in a map that had some water. So yeah, you got this uh, Tron-looking car. It's it's um, sounds electrical. Whoever knows what else in the future. It's quite cool, very quiet. Um, drives really nicely. It's a bit slow though, so maybe that's just why. Uh, what else we got? We've got this uh, hover, hover jet car. Don't know if you can actually fly up in this. Oops, I got in the wrong seat. That's the thing about this guy. You can actually get in the passenger seat and that sort of stuff in his cars, which I really like. Most people you can't do that with. Um, Try and work out if I can go up. I don't know if I can though. Um, can't find any um anyway again. But it's cool nonetheless. Um, a limousine. This you can hop in the back, which is awesome. Um, sit back here and drink some wine. If you're in a co-op server, somebody else can drive. It's awesome. Um, usually they don't have that in games, or well, have that in um, the mod packs in this, which is really sweet. You got this, which is basically um, a remodeled airboat engine, I think. So of course you can go in the water in this, and it looks awesome. Probably going to be stuck in here now. Ouch! Oh, pretty much. Um, we've got an actual boat, which I didn't spawn um, in the water. So you don't need to again, because I think it's just a remodeled um, airboat. But in the water, it looks sweet. Quite fast. Let's get out before it um, kills me. And then we got a tank. This again, you can shoot. Um, wind it up. Yeah, I like it. 
All right, so there's Sligwolves. I'm sorry I'm going through these so quickly. Um, I, just because of this, the fact that I do want to get through these without um, taking too long. Uh, you guys, of course, can just install these and muck around if you want to have a look at more of them. I can't look at all of the cars that I've got, unfortunately, because um, there are some brilliant ones I'll miss out on. Um, there we go. Ooh. And all of these, by the way, I'll go through S cars as well in a second because I forgot something. Um, but these you can actually like change the colour. Of course, you saw so you get a red one. Uh, Maserati or Suda, a dark green maybe. It's not really dark. Yeah, kind of. I'll see like a, a lime green. I made that like a dark grey. That kind of like a lighter grey. I think you can make them chromey as well, so they're not just matte coloured like this. But I can't be bothered to do that. Um, yeah, again, these are really uh, nicely modelled inside. More realistic ones again, uh, and colours got a little bit weird in, in the interior. But yeah, it's um, it's really nice. Dries quite nicely. Sounds glitchy, a bit glitchy in this car for some reason, but at the same time, I should note, some of these are working works in progress. I did see, um, I don't know what ones there are, but some of them are. This one is only a very new one, I mean, uh, this is another one that only popped up in the last two days, and it's a lovely car. I love this car in real life. If I was in the um, in the market for a, a GT car, I'd be going something like this. Just the engine, just the engine sounds in it is just I don't know. It just sounds like a Spitfire engine or something crazy. I love it. The Lotus Evora, little um, fancy little Lotus. Again, it sounds a little bit funny on that. I don't know how much of it has to do with um, the game, just can't do it or whatever. Uh, who knows? But yeah, they're very nicely modelled. Uh, they are sped cars. He's only got a few again. But as I said, you know, that Jaguar was only made in the last two days. So he's importing them across pretty quick. TDM cars. Um, this is the one that has a stack of cars. Uh, this is probably my go to pack because uh, they're always of really high quality and there's a lot of them. So. These are my, yeah, as I said, my go-to cars. They've been around for a bit longer, as you guys have, if you guys have been around for a while, you would have seen these cars, um, at least some of them. I put some new ones in, there's been some cars which weren't even released back then, such as the McLaren P1, which is probably my favourite car in the game at this point. But yeah, I'll spawn a couple of these in. The good thing about him, he has some more standard cars as well, just some, what we got, like a, like that. Uh, Chevy Spark, like my sister's car, PC Cruiser, most horrible car in the world. Um, some older cars, like a taxi. And, uh, yeah, sorry, these are spawned a bit weird, but yeah, uh, all the interiors of these are. Well, I can't really say PC Cruiser interior is beautiful, but that's not the mod maker's fault. Um, in the out, in the out old cars, um, yeah, just the amount of cars he has in there, and they're all really nicely done. And. It's just lovely. I think that's BMW M1, isn't it? Yep. Um, stupid Chevy Silverado or something. Blazer, I mean. We don't have them in Australia, really. They're only the imported ones. BMW Z8. No, 507. Got that wrong. Um, Z8 is the new one. Uh, Audi TT. Horrible car. I don't like it. <laughs> I, I, yeah. Um, don't take me too seriously when I say I don't like cars. Um, I know some people tend to take my jokes a little bit seriously. Probably not the best executed ones anyways. Keep that in mind. Um, Hummer. Like, oh, the amount of cars in this one is just... And yeah, this is my favourite. But yeah, these are all beautifully branded. You can hop in any of them and... Oh, nice open roof Ferrari. They will drive really nicely. Yeah, the, is that the Ferrari? An old Ferrari. Hummer. Oof. That sounds angry. It sounds like a truck, it really does. Uh, Beetle. Um, again, a horrible car, but an important one. Uh, Lamborghini. Sweet, another awesome open top. Sound is apparently broken. Never mind. And then my favourite. And I've got to change the colour. Make an orange. Um, colour. Oh, yeah. This thing is just beautiful. The scissor doors for starters. The engine sound is just so fast. Oh, I don't know. I just absolutely love it. This makes me so happy. I want to own one. No, but anyways. 
So that's um, about all of them. I got through this one a little bit faster than the first try, first time I tried to record it. Hopefully I didn't see um as much either. I'm quite new to coming back to videos, so keep that in mind. Uh, the one other thing I wanted to do is go into S-Cars and show you something else that I forgot to put in this. Uh, spawn in Dodge Viper, for example. These have some additional options which come in here. AI spawner, checkpoint spawner, all of these sorts of things. You can put hydraulics on a car, neon lights. Um, I'll put some lime green ones and some red ones, a little bit of Christmas tree. Did it come up? A bit hard to see in this light. Um, I don't know. I, I don't have a lot of experience in using it either, so keep that in mind. I don't know. I'll probably have to turn them on somehow. And I don't know how. Oh, there we go. You can kind of see him on the car a little bit. Um, so yeah, there's that. AI spawner. You can chuck in um, Wanda. You get tank only, which will like shoot at you. Follow me. You know, follow me. It's like my my personal pet. Please don't kill me though. No, it's not going to. Uh, I can spawn in another car. Comet. And something like a bus. Cool. Um, and I can put on Derby. Can I? And these guys are just going to go at each other now. And they'll probably fall into the water because um, there's water right there and the AI doesn't recognise it. Oh, 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 he's close. Oh, he's in. He's in. Oh, actually, oh, he's following him. This guy's just donut guy going around crazy. But yeah, um, that's the back. I hope you guys have enjoyed if you've got something out of this. Uh, I don't like asking for likes, but um, if you feel like you have got something out of it, give it a like. Um, I appreciate it. Let's me know if I'm doing a good job. And yeah, uh, I'll, again, the pack for all these is in the description. Oh, there they go. Oh, bus is on the edge. So close. It's probably trying to go into the water to chase them. Regardless, um, get in there. Get in there with all the rest. Alright, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. Pack is in the description. Um, you can just choose what you want. If there's certain vehicles that you don't uh, feel like you'd want, then you don't need to put them in. Um, overall, if you install everything, it's probably... Oh, I think it's getting closer to a gigabyte. Not quite. I can't really remember how big it is. I haven't had a look. I know there's like 66 items in the whole in the whole pack, so keep that in mind. And uh, if any mod, uh, any of these mod creators uh, watch this, thank you very much for making these. Uh, they're really good. Um, it's awesome. Some of the stuff that you can do in Gary's mod because of it. And they, of course, Gary's mod wouldn't be Gary's mod without all of these awesome uh, mods that people chuck in. So yeah. I will see you guys next time. I'm going to do the same thing for guns. Um, I'm going to do a gun pack and look at all the cool guns that people have made because, of course, that's another one that um, I did a while back but needs updating. And, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.